We're off to see the wizard, the wonderful wizard of China. A Nanjing warrior that is protecting the city wall has a request for you. Like, comment, and subscribe. So using DNP, we found our place going to Location's pretty hot. We know that this is the metro stop. There's a right. car. Uh, so we have to find coal. This is the only one, thankfully, so that's where we have to go. Today is Teacher's Day, so Kelly and I decided to take a trip, a day trip to Nanjing. Uh, we just arrived from the train and uh, we're taking the metro to where we want to go get breakfast. It has arrived! Seems a little smaller. I made it! <laughs> it's time to catch the bus. You tried. It's not worth it. arrived at the hostel. We are staying at Lao Men Dong International Youth Hostel. We got a private room here. It took us about 30 minutes to check in. Um, since COVID started, the check-in process for foreigners is now much more involved. We have to fill out several forms. Show them three different types of like, QR codes like your health code. Sometimes they ask for your code for your like, phone history. Then there's specific city code. It just gives you a green arrow. Uh, they have to check our passport and our stamp of arrival into China. Now let's get ready for our day. So we got ready and we needed to get some food and a drink. We got white peach bacteria and white peach bubbles. Bubbles. I can already tell these are going to be spicy. Yeah, this looks like something that our mouths are going to burn. Good shot. Secure Exhibition Hall. This is a free exhibit that you can go to. You just have to book one day in advance. There are three different parts that you can go to. Uh, we are only going to go to the War Memorial Hall and the Three Victories. Uh, we will not be taking any videos or anything or any pictures, so we'll s kind of tell you what it's like when we get out. We just made it back to the hotel and we wanted to talk to you about the Nanjing Massacre Exhibition Hall and the Three Victories Museum. So the Nanjing Massacre Exhibition Hall basically gives a timeline of all the things that happened in Nanjing during the Japanese Imperial Invasion of China, uh, especially in Nanjing where all of these mass atrocities happened. 
The Nanjing Massacre was one of the largest massacres within China from the Japan invasion. Over 300,000 lives were lost over a 40 day time span. The Three Victories Museum is about the three victories over Japan, Germany, and Italy during World War II. Now that we kind of told you about the museums, let's go ahead and take a look at the rest of our evening. and we are currently trying to find ourselves something to eat for dinner. We recommend a place, however, the wait is a little too long. So we're gonna try to see if we can do that for lunch before we leave tomorrow. So I kind of think we're gonna go into this restaurant. Okay. Okay? All right, let's go. Let's go. We're going with the egg fried noodles. No, you, you just you play it right there at the QR code. You can get that. I'm gonna ask for some spring rolls. They have. We are jigger. Okay. Egg first. Yeah. Big bite. Fang Guang Dai. Fang. Fang Guang Dai. Fang Guang Dai. We were walking around Fang Guang Dai um, area. Behind me is the entrance to take a boat ride. Um, boat ride through the canals and then behind James there is the Confucius temple that you can pay to enter and see. Confucius say Yo Pong which means life is better with friends. Time to walk back to our hostel with Kelly has a class to teach. Let's do it. We're on our way. Good job. A web. A crack is when something is broken. Time for brunch. Time for brunch. Start every day with a good coffee or tea. And Kelly bringing me food. Oh, just missed getting her picture taken for like the 20th time in Nanjing. We found ourselves some new friends. They're taking <laughs> photos of us. Yeah, it's good. They're practicing their photography skills. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, thank okay, you. come on. Yeah. Happy day. 
Happy day! Happy day! Happy day! So our morning went a little different than we originally thought. We were just going to do some photos for ourselves and just kind of take, just wander around the Lao Mendong um, area. However, when we were taking our photos, probably only like our second photo we were trying to take, mm -hmm. this guy with a professional camera was just staring at us, which is normal. Um, and then... We're very used to having Chinese people who bring their camera around and see us and just start taking pictures. So we didn't think any much of it, and then he was like, he's like, you can look, and, and then he asked for our WeChat, I was like, sure. Then he said, started calling his friends, and yeah. was like, come with me, and we're just like, uh, okay. And then all of a sudden, all of we these had photographers... <laughs> at least five five photographers following us around, taking pictures of us, um, it and was, it was fun. It was fun. It, it was, was fun. They showed us around Lao Ben Dong, took us to get to some good photo locations, and um, it was we got mix. all of their WeChats. Yeah, it was a mix between a Chinese and English, because neither of us really could speak fully, but it was a lot of fun. Our time's coming to an end here in Nanjing, but we're going to try to go to the Gate of China, uh, which is the main entrance to the city and maybe try to walk on the city wall for a little bit before we have to go back to Suzhou because we do work this evening. Kelly always picks the weirdest places. What? I saw noodles. Not many people, but there are people. We're upstairs. It's very small. And they use all the Chinese. We didn't translate it. So they're pointing at what they have. And some of just like, just get them one of these. Do we already do them? Don't know what I'm gonna get. But let's see. I think this looks decent. There's an egg, vegetables. Small mm -hmm. vegetables. Noodles. Can't go wrong. Now the taste test. Culture. Culture. And culture. And culture. Ouch. So to pay. Pay to get in. Two people. Two people. 55. Just bought our ticket from behind me, and now we're going to go into the uh, gate. Okay. Let's get our health codes and our mask out. Health codes, mask. Outside pocket. Yeah, I think those are the medical. Just gonna wear medical. It's fine. Health code. Yeah, We're ending our day on top of the Nanjing city wall. This wall was built in 1366 and then recently restored by the Nanjing government. We had a great time in Nanjing. Everyone we met here has been super nice and super friendly. Hope to come back to Nanjing here soon. But for now, we'll leave you here in Nanjing and we'll see you in the next video. Like, comment, and subscribe.